Hello everyone, I have made some changes to this. You see, I realized after I ended that that I was doing something wrong. I looked it up and you see how the water is going this way? And then it comes down the wheel and then it goes with it again down here that can help it have more power this is turning faster so if i were to throw some iron under there i don't think i have any left oh, also i got some other things i want to talk about in a second i don't have any iron but it would go faster to the compressing thing and i was thinking well wouldn't i rather make something that can do automated compressing so i don't have to wait for it to get picked up and stuff and then i found that there are these conveyor belts and if you take dried kelvin of formation like that you can get the mechanical belts and if i take a shaft just put it here you can connect something like that and i can hook this up with some gears let me let me see if i can make some so if i take these you know what we're gonna have to move this and then let's say i put this here and it comes over to uh no that's not the right place this has to be oh no i did it again this has to be here and then here we can connect that up oh uh, well this is one too low or maybe that's too high i don't know i don't have anything i can press currently that i know of okay, i'll be right back let me go get some iron now while that iron smelts i can show you something else i found the basin if i take this and i form it like this we can come over here and place it down there and i'm just gonna grab this chest here and then we take it and we put it underneath i'm pretty sure when i take the iron and i throw it on the conveyor belt it gets stopped pressed oh and then pops off maybe this needs to go this needs to go here uh i'm not entirely sure let's try again i'm gonna sleep we'll see if it ends up in there no it didn't where did it go what is in there do i need to move this hold on okay so i spent some time and i'm pretty sure i figured it out um you see we have shoots i was using a basin before i think i don't know what yeah basin which was completely the wrong thing i don't know why but the shoots they take the items so if i put a iron in here it takes it out of here it's like a hopper puts it in here this stamps it and it comes over here and now it's in here so that's pretty that's pretty useful um i would like to set up a way to automatically smelt the iron and then put it in here for the shoots because these shoots require plates uh also oh actually let's make a wrench since i'm thinking about it. i think it's three we can use this put three in and they're gonna get stamped And we can come back and what was the recipe? A cogwheel. And we can, where were my, where were they? Did I put them in here? Here they are. Take this, we put this here and now we can make our wrench, I think. Let's go get the gold plates. Or gold sheets, whatever they're called. And now we have the wrench. So now we can, oh, you can make it clear so you can see. Wait, I'm curious now. You can see the iron going through. That's cool. Okay, make them clear. I like it better. Um, I think you can change the direction of the... You, or you can instant break the blocks. Okay. Anyway, that's that. So I was just mining because I couldn't think of anything else to do. And we can always use extra iron. And I was coming down here and look what I found. Let's see if it's more than one. It's probably just going to be one. Oh no, there's two. Let's go. Just need one more for a diamond pickaxe. Well... Uh, anyway, that was like two seconds after I uh, finished recording that. Let's go get my stuff back. Okay, here we go. Let's see if I can get it without losing anything. Oh, nope, we didn't lose anything. Good, good. That's what we like to see. Now, I think there was some diamonds or something underneath it, but you know, at this point, it's not really worth it, I don't think. I don't remember where, though. Maybe I was just seeing things. I guess I was. Oh, look, I don't think this is a horrible way to mine, actually. Two again. Let's get five so we can get an enchanting table since we're already down here. The progression of the actual gear for this mod pack seems to be really easy, like very quickly, versus how like normal Minecraft would be grinding for a long time for these diamonds. I just pretty much started this and here we go. I know it's dark and you can't see. I'm sorry. I don't have any torches on me. Bedrock. Just one more, please. And I'm running out of pickaxes. It looks like I'm going to just have two. <laughs> Never mind. Ooh, look, so many. All right, let's get them all up. That leaves us with seven. All right, let's head back up to the surface. Seven is good enough for me for right now. Trying to die again. What in the world? Leave me alone. I just want to get out of here safe. Why does that not look like it's going to be happening? Oh, leave me alone. You definitely leave me alone. I'm not getting blown up while I'm down here. 
Yeah, I don't know where I'm supposed to be. I think I'm lost because I feel like I'm supposed to come over here. Does this connect to the surface? No way. That's crazy. Okay. okay everything is smelting. And I'll put this away. And now I need to figure out how we can automate andesite creation. So andesite, it looks like automated shapeless oh 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 we can mix diorite and cobblestone to get andesite what about diorite where can we get diorite for you can craft it from nether quartz and wash and stone smelter okay i think i'm too far down the rabbit train for that we can craft it okay uh, andesite or lava gravel flint and lava i think this is the best way to go but calcite mm, i'm about to do some research on this one actually i think it's looking like we need to do some things with ore processing because look at this crushing wheel Oh, not the water wheel. So you get the two wheels spinning in opposite directions, right? And then you throw something in the middle and it crushes them. And I think it, it I don't know what it does to the ores, but it has to do something differently than mining them. So that's what we're going to try and do here. Uh, how do I make this? Oh, I had to use mechanical crafting for it. Okay, so we should probably get that set up first. So how do I do that? Mechanical crafting. Mechanical crafter. Brass casing, electron tube, rose quartz. Nether core. Okay, so we need to go to the nether. Good thing we got those diamonds. Okay, so we have a little plan here. Nether, diamonds. Okay, where's my sticks? Am I out of wood? Oh, I'm out of wood. Um, I'll talk about it as I get the wood. Okay, we're gonna go to the nether. We're gonna get the quartz. Then we're gonna come back. Then we're gonna use that quartz to make the mechanical crafter stuff. And then we're gonna mechanical craft those big wheels. And then we're gonna start processing ores. There we go. That's a nice little plan that we got laid out here. We'll get some... No, we need water so that we can put it on the lava. Let's go to get some lava. I know there's some down here somewhere. Through here. Oh, well, that's just wonderful. What a uh, nice thing to happen to me. How wonderful. Oh, that bat just got eaten. And I only have two pieces of food. Uh, what am I supposed to do here? Let's see. Can I get down some? Oh, that's unfortunate. I do think I should go back up and get some food and I'll come back down. Actually, you know what? I'm going to be a big boy and I'm just going to run for it. All right, no unnecessary damage. Come on, we can we can get it. Well, there's all my food. There's some lava through here. The only thing I have is this. You know, I'll just mine over there. More diamonds. Perfect. Oh, not perfect. Let's see if this vein miner will work on all the obsidian. You never know. It might. And it did. Perfect. 30? That's good enough. Let's get out of here. Actually, I think we need some redstone for those little crystals. Yeah, so let's, uh, you know, let's, uh, let's grab some while we're here. Bye-bye, obsidian. Going, keep going. Okay, we got the obsidian, and let's just make another portal. I'll just put it over here. Do I have any flint, though? Hmm. I feel like I do. Yes, I do. Like this, and we need to get some netherrack, was it? Wait, what was it that we- Oh, quartz was what we needed. Oh, wow, that's crazy. Um... That, I wonder what the chances of this happening are. Oh, I forgot I have the the special nether too. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna go back through for a second and actually bring some food with me. This way. Oh no way they can see me. Uh uh. What is this? Ruby? Quartz. I'm too scared to be in here now. I'm just gonna make another chest right here. Well, that just did not want to go where I wanted it to go. So what was it I was making? Medical crafter, electron tubes, sandpaper. That so was here, and then there. And then we needed sandpaper. Ah, interesting. Okay, sandpaper. Sand plus paper. Sandpaper. Paper. Sand. Sandpaper. How do I... Whoa. That's cool. Lost rose quartz. Okay. Mechanical crafter. I need more of this plates that I made earlier. See, everything that we're doing, you know, it's coming together. Brass casing. Oh, I need brass ingots. Okay, so we're gonna have to, you know, we, we have a lot to set up here. We're gonna have to set up a, a mixer now. And I think that'll be it for today once we set up the mixer. Okay, that's a lot. Mixer, andesite casing. I swear I have the ingots, unless it's, oh, I don't have the iron. Dang. Or maybe I do. Oh, I have two different, oh, andes, there's zinc ingot. They look exactly the same. Andesite casing on the stripped wood. We grab that and we take this and then we need this we take this we take this we need one and now we have the mixer and i needed a basin i remember that because i accidentally made the basin earlier i'm just gonna put this from right here for now i guess oh that's interesting it has a sideways facing gear okay, where are my gears at i don't have any more dang okay how do i get it to be sideways then no i want it to be sideways maybe we need a gearbox i think that's what they're called right gearbox and a side casing and four cog wheels okay that's easy and then we get another one of the casings
And then we make it vertical. Right? I think I'm doing this right. I got no clue. So then it's like that. And then it's like, oh, what if I take this off? Oh, there we go. I put this mixy thing right here. Brass. Zinc and copper. Do I? I do have copper. Yay. And I accidentally made a whole bunch of zinc. So we take a zinc. Take a copper. Does it go mix it? Oh, wait, I think that it needs to be... Oh, yeah, the fire. It needs to have a fire thing underneath. So how do we get that? I think from what I saw earlier, it was... Did I run out of plating? Hmm, I'm gonna have to do some optimization here. Probably next time. I'll take that off. And then I shall add a lock here. There we go. Okay, now we can make the, the, the thing. We take this and we come here. We go one, two, three, four. Right. And then we have to go find a blaze. Leave me alone, zombie. We have to put a blaze in here. I would love to make an iron sword, but I don't have the iron for it. Wonderful. Let's go get a blaze. Easily, I could get one here. Easily. See? Look how easy that is. Now get me out of here. Then we put this guy here and we get a piece of coal. Now will it mix? Oh, I had to connect it. I had to connect it. That's right. That's right. That's right. But then we had to break that. Is it mixing? Mix. Am I doing something wrong? Is this not fast enough? Maybe this isn't fast enough. Okay. If I take this, put it here now. Base in here. Blaze guy down there. And I feed him a coal. Oh, okay. We're free. Look at that. We did it. I think that's where I'm going to end this one. Um, we did quite a bit. We got this thing set up. And yeah, I'm really enjoying this. I'll see you guys in the next one though. And you know, take care. Have a good day. See ya.